okay, you are right where you need to be. Okay, do not compare yourself to others. Okay, don't compare somebody's chapter 30 to your chapter 2. Take it one step at a time. We need to get the basics down first, the fundamentals down first. Like when we read our Bible, we start off with the spiritual milk and then we can get into the meat. Okay. Like when I first started lifting weights, I was not lifting that heavy. And I also had to make sure that I had the basics down, the fundamentals and making sure that I had proper form okay that I was doing the exercises correctly and then over time I incorporated progressive overload and then added I began to add on weight each week okay and you know sometimes it's hard seeing someone um that is successful that you know is lying, that you know is spreading false doctrine. And there have been times where I've told the Lord that that is not fair. And I, I have, I've had to quickly repent and say, I'm so sorry, Lord, because you bless who you want to bless. And that's none of my business. He gives rain to the just and to the unjust. And he giveth and taketh away like with uh, Nebuchadnezzar. <laughs> Okay, he blessed Nebuchadnezzar. And then he took the kingdom away from him, had him out here looking crazy. Okay, uh, like a wild animal. And until he humbled himself and realized who blessed him. Okay, so we can get it all back too. And a lot of times, you know, these people are not happy okay these people on social media that seem so successful and they're just living their best lives behind the camera the, you know a lot of them are miserable okay like these hollywood stars you know they have a lot of money you know they've done it all but they are suffering from depression because money does not make you happy okay we do need it my mama just said that the other day it don't make you happy but we do need it okay so god wants to make sure that when he does bless you with success with money that when you receive it is going to uh serve others okay that is that you're not going to be greedy and keep all of that to yourself he wants to make sure that you're responsible with this success okay with this leadership bro that he's going to give you with this money that he's going to give you he has to make sure that he can trust you with it um and it, it can be a painful process, you know, success is painful, you know, like with lifting weights, let's go back to the weights. When you lift, you are tearing your muscles, <laughs> like you are damaging your muscles and then they grow. How? They have to repair themselves. How do we do this? We make sure that we're hydrated, we're getting our protein. And we are resting, okay? So, you know, drink that living water. Eat your daily bread. Get that protein in. And rest, okay? Rest in the Lord. You know, don't go into overdrive. You know, rest in the Lord. Because He's going to take you there, okay? You're not going to do it on your own strength. And, you know, sometimes we need help from others, you know, we do. It's good to get advice, but remember that the main source of your help is going to be God, okay? The Word of God. He is your strength, so remember to always go to Him first for every single thing, okay? Cling to Him, 
But sometimes, you know, we may need some help. Like, you know, when when you're getting your protein, you want to get it from whole foods. Okay. So that would be, uh, you know, foods with one ingredient. <laughs> you know, chicken, ingredient, chicken. <laughs> Fish, ingredient, Chick, I mean fish. Um, and if you don't hit your protein goal, that's when you supplement with protein powder, okay? But you want to try to hit your protein goal from whole foods. And if you're lacking that day, then that's when you supplement, okay? So protein powder is something that you supplement with. So God would be the main source of protein. And then the others, your brothers and sisters, you know, people that you seek advice from. Okay, family members that are there to counsel you are the supplement. Okay, because God is the main source. Okay, always go to him first. All right. Just take it one step at a time and do not give up. Just stay consistent. Just show up, okay, and you will get there. Just don't give up. Do not give up. Oh, Lord, I forgot a scripture, okay? Remember, y'all, I hope I don't mess this up, okay? Remember the lady that you know she asked the judge to handle a case for her i think that's what it was y'all i'm so sorry y'all <laughs> lord i'm so sorry so she was very persistent and she bothered that judge every 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 day every day every day until he finally granted her request okay so how much more will God do it for you? Just keep knocking on that door, okay? And he will open it. Keep praying, keep asking, and you will receive, all right? I'm gonna have to put that scripture up here. <laughs> oh, sorry, Lord. Yeah, so, you know, you're right where you need to be. Stick to the fundamentals, to the basics. Take it one step at a time, and then you will get there. God knows when it is your time to shine, okay? You might be thinking, you know, I need to be here in this profit position, okay? I need to be um, a, a pastor and you're not even ready, okay? God will tell you when you are ready, all right? But you can always, you know, start out small, okay? Like, you know, start up a YouTube channel, ask God, you know, do you want me to start a YouTube channel? Or, you know, you don't even have to do that, but, you know, go out there and spread the gospel to people. This is practice, you know, because that can be intimidating sometimes when you walk up to a stranger and ask them if they know about Jesus. You know, some people look at, at you like you crazy. But, you know, go, you know, walk out there in faith when you go into the grocery store. Ask the Lord, is there anything that you want me to tell anybody today? And he'll tell you. And then you can go tell him about Jesus Christ. And then this will, you know, train you into your leadership position. Okay. Like I'm in training right now, you know, and I don't know how long it's going to take. Only God knows. So trust in his timing. He knows when you are ready. Okay, so keep doing whatever it is that you're doing and don't give up. Just keep showing up and staying consistent. Okay, consistency is key. I love y'all. Good night.